Welcome, Leo. <laughs> We're going to get your energy for mid-August. And look at this. My cat just jumped up here. A cat for Leo. <laughs> and what's all kinds of affection? All right. I got to do some readings, okay? All right. Come on. I know. You want lots of attention. All right. So we're going to go. <laughs> it's, it's probably going to jump up here again. But let's go ahead and see what your energy is. We're going to get a, just a, a short energy reading. And it's for the sign of Leo. Um, we're going to see what your energy is. Uh, energy of, of someone around you. Um, you know, possible outcome and uh, some advice. And look who's on the bottom. Mm, always lurking, right? <laughs> that negative energy. All right, so let's go ahead and jump in. Leah, let's see what's going on for you. All right, so what's the energy for Leo? Mid-August 2021, please. The energy for Leo. Mid-August 2021. All right. What's the energy for Leo? Mid-August 2021. Oh, that one. Okay, so we have the Six of Pentacles. So there's some kind of balance you need, like giving and taking, yin yang, all that. So there needs to be some kind of balance, or you could be actually in a balanced mood. But this is what your energy is. So you're you're balancing things out. Ah, ah, ah. Stop that digging. Balancing things out. Um, you know, and as all as well as your spiritual and your physical world. But things you're balancing things out, or you might be struggling to balance things out. But things need to be balanced out because that's your energy coming up for mid August. Okay. So let's see if there's anything else that wants to come out for you. What else is the energy for Leo at this time? Besides this balanced energy or the need to balance. That's really going to differ between different Leos here. Oh, yeah, I see why. Something to do with a um, partnership or relationship. There's a lot of worry and stress and fear and anxiety. Something's keeping you up at night regarding a relationship and it needs this this energy needs to be balanced out okay also i'm getting that there could be you're like giving a lot and the other person isn't so that's causing a lot of stress and worry in this partnership all right so now we're going to get the other person's energy someone connecting to leo's energy a person that's connecting to leo what's their energy mid-august 2021 What's their energy, please? The person connecting to Leo. Page of Pentacles. So this could be someone that's young, because the pages are usually young, young or immature. <laughs> it doesn't have to be young in age. It could be also immaturity. Um, they are actually like moving forward with their intentions and things that they're... Um, um, their gut feelings towards their material world is what they're doing. So there's something that they're working on in the material world or starting. Um, they could have an immature energy or they could be young. So, all right, let's see if they have anything else coming up. You know, for somebody out there, I'm getting that you have a, maybe a preteen or teenager and they're starting something like maybe school or college. It also could be a new job and it's really stressing you out here <laughs> and worrying you. Um, and there's got to be some kind of balance here. All right, what else for this person's energy? Someone Leo is connected to, another person's energy. All right, so we, now we have, yeah, Ace of Swords. So they've gotten some kind of clarity, and they're making a start in their mater in the material world here, some new beginning. They're getting some um, gut feelings, and they're moving towards it. But it's really got you stressed out a little bit, needing to get some balance here. Okay? All right, so now we are going to get... Um, Possible outcome for the situation? Mid August or Leo? Possible outcome. Mid August or Leo. Ooh, okay. The moon, so again, some kind of like fear based. This could be a, you know, also too, I would say um, be cautious how you approach this person or how you speak to them because they could start hiding things if they're not already. Um, just because people don't like to be confronted like head on or aggressively um, or controlled. So just be cautious with that because it does look like some fear and all that. But really pay attention to your intuition about how to handle it. All right. All right. So we're going to get a couple more for the outcome. Mm 
This could be really emotional too with the moon coming in. Something that's really weighing on your emotions. This one wanted to slide out. Yeah. Keep persevering. You'll get through it. The nine of wands, you know. You are you are getting through it. It's just like a little um, anxiety ridden and uh, worrisome and you know, but you're persevering, you know, you're getting through it. All right. Anything else for the outcome for Leo? Yeah. You know, take time to really contemplate and think things through. Don't make any rash um, opinions or, or say anything too, too quick before you think it through. So really contemplate, rest, and all that stuff. You also have the Eight of Wands. Yeah, keep moving forward, okay? Keep moving forward. All right, so now I'm going to use a different deck, and we're going to get some advice for you, Leo, okay? Advice for Leo. These ones are a little stiff still. They're kind of new, and... They're hard to shuffle, but we're going to try the best we can until I break them in. I keep trying to, but then I get busy with other things. Okay. Uh, advice for Leo. Made August 2021, please, for the sign of Leo. Yeah. It might be making you feel like you're uh, restricted and, and trapped because this person's going to do what they want to do, right? Um, or they're giving you a hard time or something like that. But, um, you know, it's how you look at it. You know, it's, it's how you look at it. You really need to take a good look at that. Don't let your fears and your anxieties and things get in the way. You know, really look at it uh, in a rational level. Listen to that gut, okay? All right, let's see. Anything else? It's hard when people want to do stuff when we keep t telling them advice, like, don't do that, don't do that, and they go along with it anyway. It does make us feel, like, really uh, out of control and, and trapped because we've been through those experiences before, especially if this is your child. It's... It can be tough, so let's go ahead. But it could be a relationship as well, or a friendship. That's too many. We did have Ace of Pentacles, like, showed up, but there was a whole bunch of under it. Ace of Pentacles is starting a new beginning in the material world. So let's... Oh, okay, there's one. One just flipped out. Yeah. Um, please make sure you look at the good things in the situation. Look, he has two cups back here, but he's focused more on the things that went wrong. Make sure you, you know, you see the whole picture and realize that... That's my washer. There's a rug in there. Um, you know, you know. Don't focus too much on the spilled cups or the things that are are are, are harsh or or um, what's the word? What's the word? Um, challenging. You know, make sure you do look at the good thing and also to kind of praise the, this person. I really feel like is trying to do something with their life moving forward. Like they have some idea and they're really excited about it. So don't just like crash their dreams a little bit, even though you know you're right and it might not work right. You know, make them feel a little good about it and try to just, like, um, use it in a different way um, and support them as well, okay? Oh, my gosh. I'm sorry about that. <laughs> it's a real, like, I should have, um, you know, balanced it out there, but it keeps, like, slamming against that. But anyway, let's see if there's any one more. So there's disappointments and the Eight of Swords restricted. You know, it's all in your head. Like, really, don't get your emotions out of whack. You know, really think about what you're going to say and do first. Yeah, listen to that intuition about your emotions and things. Um, and, you know, balance those out. You did have that balance card before you act or say anything that you might regret later or the, to push the person away, okay? So that is your message, Leo. Thanks so much for watching. Um, have a beautiful August. Take care. Bye.